Hey guys, so as you know, we hit fucking 5k and you know what that means? I'm finally gonna release my recording and render settings. But before we get into that, I just want to take the time to thank you guys from the bottom of my heart. I'm so happy that we hit 5k and that my channel is starting to do good again after I took a break. And yeah, thank you so much. Let's get into the recording and render settings. So I use OBS, it's free. OBS Studio, you can just download it. And yeah, in general, that's not really that. Yeah, that doesn't matter, but you can change the color things. I just like the dark mode stream. Yeah. Okay. So uh, for recording, I use two different recording settings. I use this CQP, take this to 19 and max quality. And if I don't use this, I use the symbol mode and indistinguishable quality large file size. And then I use something called replay buffer. So if I hit a clip in creative, I just press F8 and then it clips the last 40 seconds. So yeah. That's the two recording settings things I use. Audio, nothing much. This video, I have these two set to 1920 by 1080. And here I use the bilinear. And this is very important. If you want the secret to the smooth videos, you're gonna record in 240 FPS or just 120. Hotkeys. Nothing much. And in here I just have it this on high and this on full so the colors is a bit better. So yeah, that was my OBS settings. Now let's get into Sony Vegas and I'll show you my render settings and the secret to get smooth videos. So open up Sony Vegas. I use Sony Vegas Pro 13. So uh, let's see my project settings. So 1080p. Make this none. And... 60 fps just copy all of this this gaussian none and now let me put a clip something in and when this comes up you're gonna press yes oh yeah something important for this trick to actually work this magic trick to get smooth videos just go to switches and then put smart resample on and that's because when you record in 240 fps and render in 60 fps with smart resemble it gives this nice motion blur effect and that's the secret to the smooth video and also the render settings of course okay guys so i'm gonna show you the first render settings that i use you gotta go down to windows media video v11 make sure it's video and not audio and then you just take this 8 bit or what i don't even know just customize it and then you just copy these and copy this right here. Bit rate and click best on this. That's the first render settings that I use. I just switch between these two. The second one is this main concept AVC AAC. Then you go to Internet HD 1080p customize this and then you just copy all of this right here and this is just the gpu encode mode so just select gpu if you have vegas pro 15 or something audio nothing much and project just leave this call it something and save it the reason why i'm only gonna put this at 1080p is because after you render this let me just render it real quick so once that done open folder Hello? Okay. That shit just crashed. But yeah, what you wanna do, and this is only if you use the last render settings that I just showed you. You wanna download something called FFmpeg. You wanna make a, a batch file, I think. And then you wanna copy these settings. This right here. I'm gonna leave this in the description. That's gonna upscale the 1080p video to a 4K video. So yeah, if you put this in and call it convert and double click this, it should render the video out in 4K. So yeah, let's just wait for that. All right, it's done. And you can see the first video right here that we converted is 1080p and this video is 4K. That's how, let me just show you. Can you see all these frames right here? 
that's the motion blur that you get when you record in 240fps and render in 60fps with my resample on. So yeah, really nice motion blur. And yeah, that's the secret to make smooth videos. I think I covered everything. And uh, yeah guys, uh, this is a 5k special, but I'm gonna make one more. There's gonna be a montage that I'm gonna edit the best I can. I'm gonna try and make a really nice montage for you guys as my second 5k special. Make sure to stay tuned for that, and then I'll see you in the next video. Peace.